What is going on guys, Icepops to the late here and today we're going to be doing a Forza stream earlier we got this thing and before we do begin this is what we'll be unlocking a Dodge Super B out of the festival playlist and before we do start any of this this is what's in the Forza fun shop for this week a Toyota AT37 from 2016 Hot Wheels suit, a Hot Wheels ice car horn. The average wheel spins and a Hennessy Venom GT. Pretty cool. Okay, without further ado, uh, let's just get on with the uh, stream. And next off, as well, we usually start off with the events lab. And it looks like we'll be using A class super hot hatches. And if I just go in here quickly. And now let's begin. So it looks like I've got a few options. But I think I'll use this RS down here. As it's got a bit of colour. And not just. This looks interesting. Is this a sneak? A sneak? Yeah, this was cool. Stops the car, he lands. Cool. Good to know. Alright, so it takes about a minute and a half, a minute fifty to complete one lap. Too bad we have to two laps, so it's going to be done by now. But it's alright. We don't need a mushroom time because we need to take forever to complete these. As I and you, the viewers that are watching, have other stuff to do. It'd be a cool place to race for, like if you had, if you convoyed up with a bunch of friends. Like, this would be pretty cool to race around. These maps are pretty good. But 
I, I see. I know that people take a lot of time to make these. Maybe I should do what a AR12 YouTuber does every now and then. Go around with some maps. Record a bit of game for them. And across the line. So that was uh, easy and fairly quick to complete. That's three points on us instantly. And we have an NSX Acura from 2017. The only thing for me is I spent 170,000 on one of them about two or three days ago. Why was that not an option before? Right, how quick could we do this one? Yeah, we can we can do the uh, weekly fours of hunt challenge. That will give us five points, and I know for a fact I've got one of these as well, and fully modified. So it shouldn't take too long to do, and it's five easy points just like that. We just need our big Unimog. Right, now we can put that we just drive it. Right, nice. Uh, now we. We're next prospect here, then. So let's do this one. Actually, maybe not that. There's too many straights. But even then, that also could be a good thing as well. Don't Let's just do this. It's the closest one here as well. So if we just enter this and uh, start, it's only 4.5 miles. We are... This is probably going to end badly. But... Who knows? God, there's a full line of the animals. Landing a little bit. I'll need to full on take it out in one of these corners. I can't do that if this thing keeps tipping over. Oh, it's a fire uh, truck design. I don't like how easy this thing is to take over. Right, I think I'll have to rewind a bit more and just take the corner a bit slower. And uh, try and find it as well. So I don't want to lose too much speed here. That was nice. Actually, I may have a chance to get past now. I'm right on the uh, bumper. I'm in front. We can easily bring this out. 
five attempts of getting around that corner but I didn't know getting past later. I mean, they're better at the set, I think, just for true, but I was uh, wasted my time. Or should I save them this time? Yes, take that. My Unimog for the win. Right, what's the next challenge? Okay, so we have to get one start on that trailblazer. Alright, so if I just make a uh, filter quickly to all the uh, trailblazers around the map. Oh, it's this one right here. So I just have to get one star on it. Uh, that should be uh, fairly easy, I guess. I mean, we did only just win the uh, race. How oh, are they? Is that guy stuck? Arrived at your destination. Right, we're going back to the interior here. We're going to squeeze through these rocks. Oh no, this is a terrible idea. Alright, we're going to rewind that bit and try to follow the road a little. Five seconds for me. Just to get one star. Oh, oh. oh this is very bad. We were actually going to do it, like. Twenty-seven point three. So, how many stars would have that been? Two. About two stars I reckon that was. One is going to show me if I've completed it. Nice, so now what? Ten records, ultimate records, record scopes. So what the game wants me to drive and stuff. Well, there's one right there, so now we just have to try to keep doing this for as long as possible. That's the ultimate. Oh god, I have to get I 
worry, just have to keep doing this until the notification pops up on the screen so you can convey it. I don't know where the best place would be to do this. I just have to try to fall into different things. I did not do this now. I'm not in a very good area. Um, did it. So that's five stars right there, we just need to get ten more. Yeah, I think this is the quickest we're completing this. I'm just gonna bag these. Alright, that's a good amount. Alright, what is next? I think it'll be quicker to do these two race events. Then that'll be it, I presume. So it's C-class pickup trucks and 4x4s as well as D-class muscle. Hmm. Oh, what about this? Hypercars, alright, yeah, I like that sound of that one. Was more off-roaders, like the sound of that one, and uh, drift. Any B-class Ford, okay. Um, yeah, so we'll do this one first. I think this wouldn't be too bad. Then we'll do the muscle, even though that may take a while. It has to be seen D class, though. It's such a stupid. Or actually, no, I'd be better off doing 2 PR stunts after this. Okay, let's see what classes we've got. So it looks like the Lamborghini is our best option. But it's also the heaviest vehicle as well. So I think the F-150 Raptor is a good balance of horsepower and horsepower, weight and torque. And the Raptor is our best option here. Yeah, I'm 
one. How, how did I miss that? To what? I need a win or even be that Hummer in the next two races or I am screwed. There's no Hummer can be that quick. I, w I will not accept that. <laughs> that is a load of rubbish. Right, race number two. I need to win the next two races to win this championship. Whoa. Right, let's see how well this one goes. Times better, or even one position better, so I can actually win. Vicar switched. What a new wrong. Actually, that's the third that time. I'm going to win. Yeah, their, their car had steadily changed. They pulled out a Lamborghini. Final stretch. 
It's a win. It's a win. Just fling it sideways across the room. The crowd goes wild. Yeah. Okay, last race. That bloody thing was in the first. Oh my god, he got knocked down. Two positions in the third now. I'm ahead of a good six points. But I definitely need to win the next race. I cannot let anyone in front. Wherever the last one is. Where the hell is is it? Ah, oh, there it is. It's up here. Alright, so it's a circuit race. Right next to the Horizon Bar. Which is, uh, sounds pretty cool. Alright, let's do this. Let's, uh, let's just win this race. Get all the PR stuff stuff. I don't think the PR stuff is going to be that hard. I think the option is going to be dull. The B class drifting. Drifting. I just think someone has a bit of power. Rear wheel drive. Or even, or even four wheel drive in five months. Traction control, fling it sideways at some times. But um, I guess that's one way to get past step one, just jump right over their car. That was pretty cool. Look at that. Oh, that was insane. I assume we got three laps in this. I think this is a two I think that um, this lap is going much smoother and maybe a bit quicker than the last. Find that one to get the one. Behind mine by how many seconds?
As I say, then he swim up to try. I mean, I've got a good lead for any slight mistakes, but nothing too major. Last the car I showed off quickly before I started the stream was the uh, last car back stick as well. But that won't be the last new car this month because we have the Hot Wheels expansion in the next week or so. And the Hot Wheels expansion is very close with 10 new cars in the we have 10 new cars and an extra car back in the barn. Yeah, I've been almost expected to be pretty good. Like, I've played a lot of the Horizon 3. Let's see if Horizon 5 will top this. But we have won that race by quite a few things. So we've got a trophy truck I believe that is. And we're going to do the PR stunts and I'll complete everything else off camera throughout the next couple of days. So we can have All of this complete because look at that so far on the last two weeks of stuff. So if I do the same thing on these two, perfect. All right, let's start off with the hypercar uh, speed zone 145 miles per hour. If I start off on this side, because then we get more of a cut to go through. So, we want hypercars, and there's quite a few options, so there's my off-road Chiron, we have the Neo EP1, we also have the option of the Mercedes AMG one, for 918, let's try the 918 first. Because it shouldn't be that hard to get what 145 miles per hour through it. Is that 145? Let's just double check that. Actually, what am I doing? Yeah. yeah, 145. Right, let's see how this I've messed up with them completely. Maybe because of those AI traffic. Wow, that was a terrible. Yes, second attempt on the, 
I don't, I don't even like going that way. I feel like it's slower. Next. A-class ultimate off-roaders. So if I flash from up to this part of the motorway, I'm going to get into an A-class ultimate off-roader. It is definitely ultimate. Yes. Ultimate off-road. Maybe this may be the best option. I'll just try the truck first. That was about to say, top of A class, and it's a Forza edition. It's been pretty modified. And we have to get to 21 seconds. Or higher. Well, for a truck, this is actually uh, pretty quick. Full on Florida. I know we're not gonna make it. One second faster. And I've got the perfect solution. We are not using this truck. And We will use this Jeep because we have room for upgrades for us to get much more power. Oh, did everyone get gifted? Did I get gifted that car or something? I don't remember putting one of those on. Right, only, f only thing we need is a bit of fix. weight reduction. And a bit of power. So let's try and get as much power in here as possible. Not that much power. Alright, all right, we're at the top of A class now. So now we need all four of our wheels at full speed. Which he already is on. Tire pressure low. Car mastery, even though it's not gonna make a difference. Bubble perks will be lovely. Alright. Let's see if we can complete it this time. Oh, is that? oh wait, this was the. Uh... Halo car everyone got gifted a while ago, a while back I believe. I'm not 100% sure on that one, but I, but I think so. Speeders. Maybe smaller than a truck, but it's a bit smaller. I, bet, I think it might be a little bit slower than a truck, but it is much lighter. And the lightness is what we'll need for this, as well as much power as possible. And this car just built more for this. Right, I won't compete if the car is sad, that's for sure. As I just demonstrated again. So if I back up a bit further, if I try to go round it, like just made it again. And, wait, and it's a new record. And last but not least, to complete this. We just need to do a uh, drift zone. 
150,000. Right, we'll start off on this side over here. We need B class and direction control to lead off, as well as the Ford. Hopefully, it shouldn't be too hard. Alright, what would be a good B class car? For this challenge. Hmm. I have a feeling the Cobra could do it. Or even the Vulcan. Actually, how much horsepower does the Cobra have? Hope that should be enough. I hope. And now, to make things a little bit easier for us selves and turn the traction control off. It's actually working. So. In 400 yards, you will arrive at your destination. Come on. I don't need much. Yes, I did it. Look at that. In a bone stock Mustang. Where the hell did you come from? Gonna special All right, now let's turn traction control back on. And, uh, oh, wrong button. We have finally got the Dodge Super B. Well, 40 minutes later, so we are going to go back to the uh, festival site and check out what upgrades this car has. And I have a feeling as well, depending on what sort of engine swaps we have, this car could be a good drag build. Where's the Super B? Ah, there it is, down here. Or even just a nice car to cruise around. Ooh, that looks nice. It's got a Hemi engine in it. But that is mad. Oh no, it's a stock engine. We have a 6.2 litre V8. A 6.7 litre V8 turbo diesel a 8.4 litre v10 a 7.7 litre v12 a 8.4 litre v12 a 7.7 litre v12 a 8.9 litre v12 and a 7.4 litre v8 twin turbo So we're going to leave this stock for now and just quickly flick through some of the upgrades for it. Not very much options and there's no point in going through all this other stuff as it's just the same thing for every car and if you quickly go into the car mastery you can get XP, that's about it, that's pretty cool. And before we do end, this is the interior of the car. Old and basic, but quite nice. 
you did, if you did enjoy the content, please consider liking, subscribe, and I will see you all next time.